Android custom ROMs and asking for ETAs. So that is the topic for today's videos. A lot of you might have experienced that if you go to a Telegram group of a custom ROM and ask for, hey, when will be the June update for Pixel Experience released? When will be the August update for Havoc OS released? Or when will we get this and this and this and this? You get a warning. And some of you are like, hey, why the heck am I getting a warning here, right? I didn't do anything wrong. Technically, you did not do anything wrong. You just asked for something. But it's like it's an unsaid rule that you do not ask for ETAs. That is, when will you get the update for something which is free, right? Custom ROM developers, they do this for free. They're using their own resources. Compiling Android from source porting ROMs is not easy. Compiling Android from source, um, those of you who are curious, go have a look at the requirements, requirements of the machine, the computer. So compiling Android from source does require a pretty powerful computer and it does take some time. So either they are doing it on their computer or they are using somebody's server or they have, you know, bought a server or rented it out, whatever. Similarly for porting ROMs, it's it's not easy. So which is why it is looked down upon when you ask them for ETAs. Because it's kind of you are disrespecting them by asking for ETA and then again as I said it's free right. You cannot ask for ETA for free stuff. So let me give you like a very small example. Let's say somebody is giving you free food. You cannot go and say hey tomorrow I want this and this. He'll be like hey dude shut up it's free food. It is what it is. So pretty simple custom roms free developers do it for free they build it for free they give it to you for free so you have no right no need to get offended but you have no right to ask them for etas as to when you will get the update for the latest security patch or when will this bug be fixed or when will this feature be added again feature added is another thing which might get you a warning because dude it's his rom it's their rom right they are building it not for you. Most custom ROM developers build the ROM for themselves and then they share it with you out of their own good free will. There are some out there who just don't share and because they don't share you know about you do not know about them. So that is another thing which is why you should not be asking them for ETAs. Just be patient and that is the only thing you can do because I have seen developers quit. They cannot handle it. They just don't want to entertain it is the correct word. They don't want to entertain people asking them for ETAs and with development moving over from forums like XGA developers is like a dead place now. But most of the development has moved over to telegram groups. It's gotten even more difficult. Why? Because people are flooding in asking the same thing again and again. They DM you and then they start abusing you in DMs. Those things were easily ignored on XTA developers and other portals, other websites. But with instant messaging, it's like it gets under your skin. So again, please, 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 please do not ask developers for ETS and don't be surprised if you get a warning when you do.